The event that we're running today is a fireworks safety drama called Toast. The play was written by John McClellan and it looks at the dangers of the misuse of fireworks. This is the third year that Arkeen Theatre Company has uh, performed Toast and uh, we're covering 17 schools, uh, high schools in the South Lanarkshire area and Toast really, the essence of it is about obviously firework safety and the dangers of burns. Every year hundreds of people have to attend accident and emergency units for treatment to injuries that they've received through the misuse of fireworks. These range from simple burns to quite horrific third degree type burns. Most of these injuries occur to people under the age of 16. That's why we've targeted this play at that specific age group. But it also goes into uh, wider issues of bullying and peer pressure and how you know people people cope with that and people are, are kind of pressurised and put under stress by that, particularly the main character, uh, Ryan. We feel that through drama it's a fantastic way to put across a dynamic and a message in an entertaining way because it can be quite difficult um, for pupils to be able to relate to such messages especially if it's just through pamphlets, leaflets, um, even DVDs. This way they're getting the experience of a live presentation with actors that I feel that they could probably relate to as well. well you've got the characters Lindsay and Ryan. Lindsay is playing the main bully throughout the play and Ryan being the one that's being bullied. And Lindsay shows us many examples of you know, bullying Ryan and, and kind of peer pressure. And Ryan shows us what happens. As a school we feel this is a really important uh, performance to deliver to the children. There are a lot of key issues there which um, we deal with on a daily basis and we do feel that it can, we can't do everything within the classroom so it's important to vary the teaching. I think there's a, there's a few kind of shock tactics in the play that make the, make the kids jump and I think it, it works quite well. <laughs> serious message out because like I seen like a couple of people like jump. I got a shock at I got a shock at the bit where she flung the banger. I think the play was quite funny but then some bits were like quite scary. Rockets that he sees that light up the sky in actual fact travel at 150 miles an hour. So if you're on the receiving end of that it's quite devastating. It did keep me interested. I just didn't know why I take my eyes off it. When you look around the audience during the production, there's a vast amount of emotions. Um, there's laughter, you know, there's, um, there's worry, there's a wee bit of, you can tell they're getting scared as well, because it is a hard-hitting drama, especially at the end. You can even feel that there's some of them getting a bit squeamish, you know, about what's actually happened to Ryan. In the classroom, you can't really do that. Um, the teacher can, can highlight the issues, but the children sort of embraced that performance so well and they, I think they, they responded much more positively to it. And I can see them going out now at their lunch break and discussing it with their friends and, and talking about the dangers. Um, and they'll, they'll, they'll laugh at some of the things that were discussed within the play and how the actors portrayed that. But certainly I think they've got the serious message of... Um, been affected by peer pressure bullying and using fireworks in a dangerous way. After the production uh, we have uh, follow-up workshops. Children come up and they confront some of the characters like Lindsay who was the bully uh, or Ryan himself who was, being, who was the victim who was being bullied and have conversations with them about um, what they think they should do about this and how, where they should take it, how they should tell someone about it and how they can help and I think that's very important as well for the pupils to know there is a network of support out there. If they are getting bullied or if they are under peer pressure, don't end up with your face like Ryan's. Go and talk to someone about it. There's other choices out there. It did really grab my attention because it makes me realise what could actually happen, like being childish with fireworks and the real bad effects of it. The great thing about this play, because it is so hard-hitting, when the performance finishes, 
it doesn't just finish after the 35 minutes. The pupils do take the show and they take it out into the streets, telling their mums, telling their friends and family about the play, what they had seen and the reaction, you know, what, what made them feel and their emotions. Well, seeing it, seeing it as a play rather than the teachers talking about it really just shows you what kind of effect it could have and just stupidity could ruin your life. The play, like, was quite funny sometimes. But mostly serious to get like all the big messages out, not to play with fireworks, and also like bullying. You should never bully people, and you should never like peer pressure anybody. That they can make their own choices for themselves. And if I was like, in a crowd with people that and everybody had like fireworks, I would just like walk away and instead of being in danger, because then like, friends could like have a laugh and try and point it at you, and then it could easily just come out, and you can end up with people and toast. Ultimately, this gets the messages across about peer pressure, bullying, the dangers of the fireworks, um, and obviously your, your network of support. And it's great to know that they have taken all that in and they will take it away with them and they have learned something today. This was absolutely superb and we would love to continue with this and dealing with these issues in this way with our pupils. The play was absolutely amazing. It's an easy way just to get, like, the message across definitely from fireworks has changed the way I think about fireworks. <laughs>